guys welcome back to caveman mining on today's video you can guess what we're doing we have this three shelf storage unit from Home Depot cost uh, $25 along with the misfit mining GPU hangers courtesy of our friend chump change XD and the folks over at misfit mining community uh, who do all the 3D printing and such sent me over six of these things and I was really excited to give it a try. What we're going to be doing is uh, taking the existing motherboard that I have. It is the Asus Z97 uh, motherboard. It is the one from Facebook Marketplace that I picked up as a freebie. Someone was throwing it away in the trash and just posted Whoever could take this thing and had a working power supply, uh, Intel uh, i7 uh, processor. So I was pretty pumped to get that going. So we're going to take this along with the two GPUs. We've got the 3060 uh, light hash rate RTX card. You saw me test out in the newest RX 6600 XT. And we're going to take both of those cards to start and get those on the GPU hangers. Uh, additional plans to that, I also have the two RTX 4000 cards on the test bench. I want to take those off so I can free up the test bench. And you see here, I still kind of have a little bit of a mess, so I want to uh, kind of reorganize. Uh, I flipped the uh, f uh, 8 GPU um, rig around just so you guys could see uh, I was working with airflow trying to get a better airflow but uh, didn't really make much of a difference so we'll probably turn that back around and um, yeah as you can see on the garage floor and around we've got quite a mess here so that's the next uh, order of business uh, to attend to but uh, yeah I'm really excited to get this thing going and try these hangers out and we'll see how it all looks and uh, next time you guys uh, see the next frame we will have this uh, thing built and we'll have the infamous snap in three two one all right guys so we got the wire rack shelf assembled now and uh, it was a little bit of pain in the butt these clips are kind of kind of finicky in here but uh, yeah I think this should work out pretty nicely um, in terms of you know, clearance-wise, I think uh, I think we're gonna fit just fine. I think uh, we've probably got close to about a foot of clearance. And uh, let me see here. Let's get this thing practice clipped up here. Let's see. There we go. Just gonna get used to that. So yeah, check that out. Looks quite nice. And just got the tape measure out here. Got just about close to a foot, I would say, of clearance on this side. And this side is probably a little bit bigger. So we get about 13 inches uh, or so on the bottom. So that should fit all of our cards. Uh, it might be a little bit tight. Probably would have, you know, gone and went to get a little bit bigger of a uh, shelf but uh you know for example the 3060 card is about just about 10 inches uh there and looking at like the 3090 card that's about uh just about over 12 inches so we'd be able to technically squeeze the 3090 on the bottom uh shelf here but uh yeah we'll uh go ahead and start putting things together here we've got the uh, clips to uh, be able to rest the motherboard on so we'll take a look at that and uh, yeah so far so good we'll see how everything fits all right so now we are going to uh, stop the miner we've got the uh, the rig going here a couple cards let's make sure we kill that and we're going to do a shutdown completely uh, we'll power off the PSU in just a second and get everything uh, unplugged and we'll move everything over to the Y-Rack shelf and we've got the little clips uh, on here so we'll be able to uh, kind of mount the motherboard to the bottom of the, uh, the frame.
All right, so we've got the uh, little standoff clips here. You can see the plastic uh, connection on the bottom, so they just sit quite nicely. So, uh, yeah, let's see, we've got four of them, which should suffice. We'll pop the last one in here, and uh, we'll get them connected up nice and snug here. All right, so we got the little clips for the power supply there. There's four of them to just kind of hold it in place so it's not sitting on the wire rack. Uh, shelving just so there's no shorts or anything like that so pretty pretty ingenious uh, clip uh, setup there pretty cool we're gonna go ahead and get the cards uh, mounted up to the hangers and we'll hang them on and get some stuff connected up all right so you got the uh, the hanger uh, clip that goes on to the mount for the GPU and you want to slide the bottom piece on first and up and then you've got the screw uh, screw hole on top, so it's a flathead uh, screwdriver, the screws that they've provided. And uh, you don't want to like over tighten, but you want to just put uh, enough kind of torque to where it's snug. And you'll hear it like the plastic start to go a little bit, so it's fine if there's just a tiny bit of wiggle room because there's a little inlet on the bottom that will allow it to, uh, to slide in there. So. Let's take a look. All right, so we got one card mounted up in there and it looks pretty good. So far, so good. Got an okay clearance from the motherboard. And uh, yeah, we're gonna put the second card up there in just a second. All right, we got the second card up there. We're gonna have to get uh, the riser and stuff configured up and connected and then what I'll do is I'm going to power this on before we uh, add any more cards to this rig. Alright guys we did a little bit of rearranging we moved the 8 GPU king wing frame over to the left side uh, we took uh, all the cables kind of cleaned it up in here got some new uh, sticker apparel so uh, thanks to all the OG's Red Panda Chump Change XD and the hobbyist miner, we've got your stickers rocking here to get some good vibes. And uh, yeah, we've got the uh, the hanging cards uh, set up, and we're going to turn the power button on, and hopefully nothing blows up here. So let's see. Got some cards spinning here. Got the 3070 going, and motherboard is going. Sorry for the fan noise here. Just. Uh, Probably should have turned that fan off, but uh, yeah, we're gonna go into Hive OS and see how things are going. I have a feeling that the uh, uh, 6600 XT is not getting any power. I might need to get the uh, riser going on that one. All right, guys, so we've got uh, both cards fired up, powered on, everything going. Let's get into Hive OS and take a look and see what we have here. So it looks like we're on and hashing. Got Ravencoin going. Two cards active. Uh, we are finished cleaning up a little bit. It's not perfect looking, but uh, it'll do for now until I get some time to, to uh, clean a little bit of those, more of those wires up. But uh, yeah, I got the two cards going there, the uh, 3060, 6600 XT. Uh, tied down the power supply tightened it up with um, some zip ties to allow the uh, the clips, the 3D printed clips to them to kind of lock in. So I would recommend doing that if you have a wire rack uh, shelf. Uh, the clips are great. Uh, they just move around a little bit. So you need the power supply like tight down to the actual frame and then the clips push up against it, which keeps it nice and tight. But uh, yeah, everything's fired up here. We've got the monitors going, all the rigs fired up, hashing away. So uh, yeah, guys, I am pretty pleased so far in terms of the setup with these Misfit Mining uh, GPU uh, hangers. And like I said, I'm gonna get two more of those cards and uh, I guess whatever other cards I buy, I'm probably gonna stick uh, on this rig and hang on the top shelf. I don't have that much room over the middle here, which is, which is fine, um, that's okay. I could probably squeeze a card here uh, facing uh, outward if I wanted to, but I could 
fit quite a few uh, cards up top and just run cables down through the risers. Uh, one other thing, I'm, this power supply, uh, it's a 1200 watt uh, BFG, I guess, um, part of the freebie rig. It only has a couple slots for PCIe uh, power. So uh, what we'll do is probably put another power supply, this uh, Corsair 850 uh, watt uh, up on there and potentially can join those two together with an adapter I have hiding away. But uh, yeah, guys, at this point, I'm gonna go ahead and clean up the rest of this mess in the garage before my, my wife uh, divorces me because it's just been insane mess here. But uh, I appreciate you guys taking the time to check out the uh, GPU hanging uh, rig. I hope you learned something. Uh, definitely go check out those rigs, buy them. Uh, go to the Misfit Mining Discord to uh, get a quote for those guys. But uh, yeah, highly recommend so far. And um, yeah, guys, if you like what you saw, hit that like button and subscribe, and we will see you on the next video. Take care.